Google Analytics is Google's premier web statistics and tracking tool. While your X site already contains its very own web statistics, some more advanced X site users prefer Google's more powerful tool, as it can also help you relate your web traffic to your site's goals and purposes. For example, through Google Analytics, you can see not only how many visitors have been on your site, but also much more detailed information that lets you analyze how sticky your website is, or how well it retains your visitors once you've got them. Google can show you how many pages the average person visits, the average amount of time spent per visitor on your site, the percentage of visitors who bounce back to Google after landing on your site and choose another result instead, and much more. Since the information comes directly from Google, it has authority that counts when it comes to your website's ranking. First, you'll need an account with Google. It's free, and if you have a Gmail account already, you can just log in with that. Next, enable Google Analytics on your Google account by going to google.com, click Business Solutions, then choose Analytics. Click Sign Up Now. Once you have an account, Google will provide you with a bit of code to add to your site so that they can start tracking your visitor activity. To get this tracking code, you'll need to log into your Google Analytics account, and on the website profile screen in the lower right-hand corner, click Edit. In the screen that appears in the upper right-hand corner, click Check Status. On the final screen, scroll down to find the box that contains the code. Click inside that box and use Ctrl-A on your keyboard to select everything that's in that box. Then use Ctrl-C on your keyboard to copy that information to your clipboard. Now that you've got the code, let's add it to your website's footer so that Google will see it on every page. To do this, log into your Xsite admin account and click Xsite in the top header. Once the Xsite wizard loads, click Site Footer in the content pane on the left. Check the box to include a custom footer, and then click Customize. A new window will appear. In the editor, in the bottom left-hand corner, click the HTML mode button that looks like two blue brackets. At the end of any existing code, use Ctrl-V on your keyboard to paste the code you copied from Google. When done, click Update in the bottom right-hand corner. Finally, click Save in the Site Footer step to save your changes. That's all there is to it. You'll have to wait at least a day so Google can collect enough data to show anything, but in the next day or so, you should be able to log into Google Analytics and see at least some recent visitor activity. Now Google can show you information only they can provide to you, such as how many pages the average person visits during their stay, the average amount of time spent per visitor on your site, and especially the percentage of visitors who bounce back to Google after landing on your site and choose another result instead, so you know how many stick around and how many go to your competition. There's even more Google Analytics can do for you. For a detailed tour of what Google Analytics can do, feel free to check out the Google for Webmasters video on Google's website. Or you can also find Google Webmaster Help in their channel on YouTube.